So as you can tell, I am not in my bedroom right now, I'm in the kitchen, and today we have a special baking video. So basically, I saw this tag on Adub's channel, her name is Alex, and um, it looked really, really fun. So it's called the Bake My Life tag, and basically, you have to bake some sort of um, dessert, or you can like cook something if you want to, but you have to add ingredients that symbolize things that pertain to your life, if that makes sense. It's kind of hard to explain, but you'll see in the video as we get further into it. I thought it would be super fun to do this, so if you guys think this would be fun, then you guys should definitely um, take a video of yourself doing this and um, let me know and I'll check it out. I do like to bake. I think it's fun. Not that good at it, but you know. So first, I'm going to make the cake batter for this. I'm using the Funfetti cake and I'm going to make little cupcakes. And um, if you guys haven't heard of Funfetti, it's so cute. They just have like little confetti colorful things in the cake batter, so let's do this. If you've seen this tag before, then you know that this cake batter is going to get extremely ruined. So, I'm going to section it off. Um, do one batch with the video and another batch on its own, so one batch will be actually edible. <laughs> here is the lovely cake batter. It looks... Oh my gosh. Hey, Dad. Alright, so here's where it gets very interesting but very fun. <laughs> I'm going to add some hot sauce because sometimes I can be really sassy. And yeah, um, I have a little temper sometimes and just get a little sassy. So I feel like hot sauce will do the trick for this. And that'll work. Okay, so another little thing I'm going to add is ketchup because you guys may not know this, but the Bryan family here in my household and just our family in general, we have an obsession with ketchup. We all love ketchup, so we're going to add some ketchup into this. Do three squirts for good measure. So another thing that you may not have known about me is when I was really young, and still to this day, I have been obsessed with peanut butter. I just always have and always will. So I love peanut butter, so I figured um, that would be an important thing to add in here because peanut butter plays a very huge role in my life. <laughs> Got the trusty spoon. Okay, here we go. We'll just add about that much. What do you think? Maybe? So I have like hamburger buns here basically because um, I'm in marching band at school and at school we have a signature hamburger or cheeseburger that our school likes to make for like football games in like the fall football season. So throughout my first year of high school, we all would like eat these hamburgers and stuff like um, after we would do our show for marching band and after um, football games and stuff. To represent that, I'm going to add a little bit of hamburger buns in here. <laughs> oh god. It's looking pretty nice if I do say so myself. So you can probably tell by how I look right now. Um, or in general how I look. I am half Filipino and half white. So because I'm half Filipino, we love rice. So I'm gonna add rice. <laughs> I'm just gonna sprinkle it. Did you guys see that? Let's do some more. Just gonna sprinkle some rice in there, you know, for good luck, whatever. Every winter break, um, and actually one time in the summer too, but most of the time every winter break we go to Florida to visit my grandma and um, I wanted to add some orange juice in this to represent that because um, Florida is known for their oranges so um, I just love going there in Florida for vacation and stuff. It plays a big part in my life. I love seeing my family while I'm there um, so I figured I should add this in to represent those times in Florida so I'm just gonna... Oh my god. Oh my god. Sometimes I'm pretty shy and not that many people know that I guess. I don't know. I, I can be pretty shy sometimes. So on the outside, like a banana, um, I can just be a little shy and stuff and, okay, well bananas aren't shy, but, okay, basically what I'm trying to say, on the outside I can be pretty shy and then once I open up to you on the inside, um, I'm a crazy person, basically, and I'm not that shy once I get to know you. So with the banana, on the outside, you know, it's whatever, it's brown, it's gross, and but then on the inside, it's nice and pretty. <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to tell you guys here, but I hope you kind of make the connection. Do you understand what I'm trying to do? I'm a banana, basically. When I was little, I used to live on a boat with my family, and it was for a couple years, I think. Um, we traveled to the Bahamas. We went 
up and down the intercoastal waterway and we um, went to Florida and stuff. We did a lot and um, that was a really fun time for me, I guess, when I was little. I really don't remember that much of it, but I do remember little bits and pieces and I just remember it being like such a dream, you know. You just get to travel on the ocean in a boat with your family. So it was pretty fun from what, like, from what I can remember and from what people tell me, I guess. So to represent that, I'm going to add some sea salt to represent, you know, the ocean, salt water, that kind of thing. To this day, I still love being on the water and stuff, so I love the beach, I love going out boating and all that, so sea salt is an important ingredient to add to represent that in my life. My friends and I love going out to Mexican food. We do that all the time. It happens a lot. When we're bored, we're just like, hey, let's go to Mexican. So, in honor of that, oh my god, I'm adding some salsa in here just to represent all those times that I go to Mexico with my friends in the many more times that I will. It's like a tradition. We go like every two seconds. I also wanted to add some more salt because I have a temper sometimes and that kind of goes along with the hot sauce. But sometimes when I get a little frustrated, I can be a little salty. <laughs> get it? Yeah. We're going to mix this up now. Do you see this? It's gorgeous. So I think they have cooled down enough. So I'm gonna be icing them. So today I'm using the, let's see, Pillsbury Funfetti Happy Birthday Hot Pink Vanilla Icing. It comes with sprinkles too. Look how hot pink that is. Like this looks like Play-Doh to me. And I am not a professional cake decorator or anything, so this is gonna be a drastic disaster. So let's put some icing on. Oh, this is a fail. All right, I'm gonna do another one. So cute. I only iced the ugly ones, part of the Bake My Life tag. So here is the final reveal. I'm going to eat this cupcake. Basically, this cupcake summons up my life. So I'm gonna eat it and see how it goes. Hopefully it's tasty. This is the, this is the moment of truth. It looks nice, like it doesn't look disgusting. It smells really bad though. It smells, it smells like a rotten taco. This is disgusting. Basically, if my life were a cupcake, this is it. So you take a bite of it and it tastes like cake for a second and it tastes normal. And then it's like banana, then something spicy. I'm guessing it's like the hot sauce, pretty nasty. But this is me in a cupcake, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this little Bake My Life tag. I hope it was somewhat interesting or funny. Um, you guys should definitely do this tag. I think this is so fun and hilarious. So definitely do it and tell me if you do and I will go check it out. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. And all my men, she made it clear, lipstick can be wrong. My summer, summer, my sweet summer is gone. My sweet summer is gone.